Hey guys, it's Parker. Today we're taking the 2016 Ford Focus down to Ford's Research and Innovation Center in Palo Alto, California. Let's take it for a spin. We're inside the Focus and it is a titanium trim level. And the great thing that Ford has done is in a way built a Focus for everyone. I've driven the Focus ST. It's a lot more fun with the two liter EcoBoost engine and a manual transmission. Now they've released the Ford Focus RS, which promises to be an absolutely incredible car. All wheel drive, 350 horsepower. That's a recipe for success. Ford cares about safety. Ford has a NHTSA five-star crash test rating for the Focus, and it's also got a ton of features that help you be more alert and confident on the road. For instance, you've got Lane Keep Assist, which can apply small amounts of torque to actually keep you within the lane if you start to drift. The Focus also has blind spot monitoring, so if someone comes in your blind spot, you've got an amber indication uh, in your left or your right side view mirror that lets you know that someone is there. Let's talk a little Little bit about park assist. When you activate park assist, this system will actually turn the steering wheel for you. All you have to do is provide brake inputs and gas inputs, and it actually works pretty well. I'll be honest, the first generation of Sync wasn't all that great, but Sync 3 in the 2016 Focus is a massive improvement and is a lot like uh, your typical smartphone. You can also pinch to zoom in on the maps. Like I said, very, very fast. Go over to App Link. You've got a whole host of third-party apps. As you can see, Sync 3 is activated right now and it's actually connecting your smartphone to the multimedia screen. So now I can put my phone away, still stay connected and focus on the road. So let's get going. Parker Nierenstein, nice to meet oh, you. Oh, Annette, I'm a vehicle engineer here at Ford. Looks like you just got to test drive our 2016 Focus. What's really cool with what Ford's done with the Focus is kind of offer an engine or an interior trim level for everyone. That's the idea. Focus offers a two liter inline four, turbocharged EcoBoost engines that enhance performance and efficiency, and even an all electric model. And then Sync 3, you guys majorly improved that over the last one, which is kind of sluggish. Yes, the latest generation of Sync 3 is much more responsive. The eight inch screen works just like your smartphone. You can swipe, pinch to zoom, and tap it. Hopefully you had a chance to play with App Link and use the voice recognition to pull up your favorite playlist on Pandora. Seems like Ford is trying to make your life easier. Absolutely, you're always on your smartphone. This vehicle now has two USB charging ports that um, charge your phone twice as fast as it did before. In addition to the NHTSA five-star crash safety rating, Focus also has safety technologies like the rear view camera, which can help make you a more confident driver by letting you know what's behind your vehicle. And it helps me because I'm terrible parking. There so. you go. <laughs> <laughs> One thing I loved about it is, again, it feels like a higher-end car uh, than its price point and its competitor. I'm really impressed with what the Ford Focus has to offer. Seriously, thank you so much for having <laughs> me out here. really, really cool. Thanks for watching. Be sure to subscribe to the Ford channel for more videos and let us know what you think about the Ford Focus in the comment section below.